more stories about your Uncle George? Yeah, just a minute, I, I cut it short. Um, after he flunked out of college, he was able to drive a car. And my aunt Lola Bell and Uncle Bud Champion owned a cotton gin and grew Peaches commercial and all that and they, were, they did very well. They didn't have any children. So they hired Uncle George to drive the truck from the cotton gin to the railroad station once the cotton had been ginned and baled to be shipped. And they said there was an old fella who used to just hang around the cotton gin all the time. He, he didn't work or anything. And every time Uncle George would start out with his truckload of cotton, this fella would jump in the truck and ride with him. So after a while, Uncle George decided, I'm going to fix this clock. So they were headed up the road, and in those days the roads were not paved. And he put the metal pedal to the metal. And he took his hands off the steering wheel. And here they are with a load of cotton in a truck, and he's not steering the truck. And the guy says, aren't you going to put your hands back on the steering wheel? Uncle George says, just be steady, brother. Just believe in the Lord, and everything will be all right. And he let it go a little fall up the road. They said the guy never got back to truck with him again. <laughs> <laughs>